We've got a breaker popper. I mean, as soon as you throw the breaker, it snaps back. It's like, Ch -ch -ch. so it's popping immediately. And it's a Goodman. It's a 13 sear Goodman, four ton. All right, let's pull the, I'll take the cover off and we'll check it. All right, for those that have seen my other HVAC videos where the breaker's popping, you know, I always start with the crankcase heater. Crankcase heater's good. Oh no. I bet it's a compressor. All right. I'll start with the uh, herm up here. Just discharge the cap. Power's off too, by the way, guys. Make sure you got your power off. All right, we'll start with the start winding. This would be Herm off your compressor. All right, we took the yellow wire, the Herm off the capacitor, which is your, your start winding. No. These just plug in. Come on, baby, give me something a little, give me something burned. Everything looks good. I think we got a bad compressor. I'll show you another way to check this too. With just your continuity on your meter. Oh, well poot. Everything looks good. Yep. Break the meter out and I'll show you another way I double check. Alright, here's the way I, I double check it after I've used the uh my subco mega set my meter to continuity and I touch one of my leads to the copper pipe and then one to the winding prongs or the pegs on the compressor and if it beeps your compressor is shorted to ground yep hear that beep start winding. I'll roll through the other ones. No beep on run, no beep on common, just the this, this start. Well poot guys, it's only three years old. It was installed three years ago. Maybe I'll record a uh, compressor video. Sometimes the owner gets pissed and makes the guy that the installer come out, come out and do it so we shall see. But yeah, man, that's how. That's two ways I check to see if compressors are bad. I do it with my subco, then I break the meter out and test it with the continuity. All right, back compressor. Thank you all for watching the Dirty Maintenance Show.